Look at this shake weight. This is how we do it. While everybody's getting on, I figured I would just sit here and do this shake. That's what I thought. This is how you lose fat right here, guys. Take your side apple cider vinegar shots. Take your apple cider and your cayenne pepper. Do your fasting, intermittent fasting. Do your cardio. Do your cardio. Hey guys, I'm Casey, creator of Hot Mom's Lifestyle with a Z. And I am still in my gym clothes from today. Yes, it's a Monday. And we're going to come on here today and we're going to talk about mainstream stuff and just why it ain't working and why. I still got cellulite and no energy energy and you blame everything on hormones you think you're just getting older you think you're not motivated you think you need to do more in the gym you think you need to do another diet you think you need to do all these things and you've even tried to do all those things you've tried to take all the supplements spend all the money go to the hormone doctors do insulin resistant training courses hire trainers take ozempic i've never tried to do that but just i've done it all literally two a days work out harder take all the stuff see ya. and i was gonna do this thing in the background for a water feature didn't think about the freaking glare so now i've just got to put pictures in the corner here anyway here's the deal i was posting something today about christmas slay it challenge the slay it challenge and i just had a thing come through and i gotta be honest with you i've gotta be honest i was even scared to say it i was scared to say it but seriously the reason why people like working with me is because I give it to you real. I, I, I don't hold back and I cuss. I may cuss on here so if you have the kids around, don't have the kids around. But seriously we're grown and I'm almost 40. I've had two C-sections. Lost one in between. I've had a total hysterectomy. Shouldn't be successful. Had things that doctors told me I could never cure and I did. Yeah. And I did and that's why women that come to work with me, they do all those things. They do all those things. They're like Casey, can you help? I've tried everything and I don't know how to lose weight. You haven't tried everything because if you did try it and you did hit the thing, you would not be where you're at. And here's what it comes down to. And I have a whole training on this. I'm going to give you that training, but I have a whole training that talks about nervous system regulation. The reason why you're not where you want to be and you're using like shake weight mentality, shake weights, this is the equivalent of saying apple cider vinegar shots, cayenne pepper, intermittent fasting and all that cardio. And here's the deal. Look back in your life and think what happened? What's the first thing that comes to your mind when you think what happened? Here I am almost 40 midlife awakening, which is another program course that I have. You're like, here I am, midlife awakening. Is it that I had kids? Did I just get older? What's wrong with me? Your nervous system has kept score is what happened. Your 20s, your past lived experiences, all those years you ate and did way too much. You're probably still doing it. You're probably still trying to live on caffeine and force things into being, doing everything for everybody, feeling like a savior to everybody, feeling resentful, feeling like you're dreading the holidays because there's some toxic family members you got to deal with. And there's just a lot on your plate that you have to do. I don't care who you are living like that is part of the reason why you're stuck. And that's all in the nervous system. It's, it's the reason why women do all the right things. They're still low energy. They're trying to do the diets. They're not working. And I said today, I was like, at the end of the day, listen, and and I really don't like this camera angle right here. I just want to put that out there for this Instagram camera angle. I just need a, I'm trying to get a whole new setup here and I just don't like this angle, but whatever. Here's the deal. We talked about the Slay It Challenge for the holiday. And I was like, I could just post some clickbaity shit that says, hey, lose 25 pounds before Christmas so that when you gain five, you look good that would get everybody in and it can happen but here's the deal what happens like why can't you follow your diet because that's how you lose weight by the way that's how you lose weight and body fat if you want stellar results quickly start tracking your macros religiously find out what your maintenance is drop a little bit below maintenance get some workouts in oh you tried that you're not motivated you're doing it you're doing it it's still not working you don't know what's going on you think it's hormones yeah your hormones are probably shot your adrenals are shot your nervous system is like non-existent you're in fight or flight and survival there's no workout plan for that there's no nutrition plan for that. There is, I shouldn't say that, like we have a specific custom way to do this and get your body back into a state of parasympathetic so that it can release the fat. However, the workouts you're doing, the diet, and even the foods you're eating, like you're probably not supposed to be even eating that food. Have you even checked your DNA to see if that's what you can have? Have you checked your hormones to see if that's what you can actually have? It goes way beyond testosterone, estrogen, and progesterone. It goes way beyond IgG blood tests. And then have you checked in with your soul? Have you checked in with your the soul of you? Or do you just still feel like something's missing and you just feel disconnected? connected and if you just you need some private time matter of fact you don't even know when the last time you could hear yourself think it's been a minute right so everybody's sitting here worried about diets and workouts i'm like if that worked you would not be here right now because that's the easiest that's how easy it is to lose fat and weight by the way so why does everybody fail at it it's because it's emotional duh it's emotional it's emotional and not until you understand that your emotions your nervous system dictates how much weight you lose how you lose weight is it going to come back on and all that if you you don't feel safe and your body's not going to release the fat. It's not going to restore your hormones. There's a reason why women like me and other women who are winning way older has what had stressful lives. How come they seem to just 
the same problems you have, but they can just step over them. It's not even a big deal to them. It's because their nervous system, they have the capacity, their nervous system is, is, is healthy. They're not in fight or flight. One little thing, by the way, it's like a video game. Wherever you're at right now, like one little thing can take you out. That's why things feel like so big to you. So you have to understand that it's the soul of you. Soul healing, nervous system healing. And I was talking to a physician today, surgeon, female surgeon. And she says the same thing. She will only work with patients who do all of the things. Acupuncture and actually acknowledges there is a soul in you and there's a nervous system versus just the physical, just medicine, just hormones, just diet, just workouts. I think at this point, we're all older now. If you've ever, we're not in our 20s anymore. Matter of fact, our 20s are what we're paying for right now. This is the reason why women go through midlife crisis. It's really midlife awakening. Some women choose to go through the crisis. I chose to go into the awakening part. Many do. And this is why we get hella results. Meanwhile, there's women over there with a shake weight mentality. I'm going to the doctor. I'm going to do apple cider vinegar. And I'm going to do intermittent fasting. And this one for insulin resistant. And this one. Jesus. I don't know when you're going to wake up. Seriously. It just gets back to the soul of you. If you cannot set boundaries with yourself, you don't feel safe. You don't feel, you feel guilty for having the hot body and having time alone or telling somebody to F off or I, I, I don't know. I, I don't know what to tell you. It's just like you have to understand about your emotional mental health, the mind, body, soul. Unless you've been living under a rock, you have to acknowledge this part of you or it's going to, you're going to just continue your mother's lineage, your mother's lineage. Everybody's struggling. Oh, it's just in our, it's in our DNA. Just, that's just how we are. Yeah. You're going to be just like your mom, just like your mom, just like all the women there. If you continue to do that, your daughter, are going to have the same kind of mom as you have. One that doesn't know how to take care of herself, just puts herself on the back burner, taking care of everybody else, can't get her life in order, thinking she's sick, thinking she's broken. There's nothing wrong with you. You just never have even ignited who you really are. You don't even know who you really are. You don't even know really what you want. Some people think they're depressed and I'm like, your hormones are low and you're not living life in alignment with what you actually want to do. You're doing what you think you should do. Yeah, there's that. But yeah, I just had to come on and say that this morning. Dieting and exercise is so easy. It's so easy and you know that. What gives? What is it that, that makes women really get stuck? It's emotions. This is why we, first thing when you join any of my programs, we do hormones, we work physicians, we do the food and gut testing, we biohack, we activate new strains of DNA, we do all that. But you're going to go straight into the nervous system reboot, reset and restore. You're going to learn why you're tired, how to seal up your energy, where your energy is going that you can't even see with your eye. It's crazy. And when you see it, you can't undo it. This is why you'll never go back. Only forward. It's crazy, but it's really not. I think actually what's crazy is women doing the same thing they've always done and just, I'm just stuck. I don't know what to do. You're just staying in victim mode because you're not choosing, you're not literally, you don't have to be struggling. You don't have to struggle. You said, I just got emotional listening to you because I'm speaking to your soul. I'm validating your you. I'm validating you and how you feel. You've never felt seen before. You have never felt like somebody under you've never had non-judgmental enlightened witness. That's what's going on. So what's really happening is it's not thyroid. It's your mother wounds. You're over, you're saving everybody else, feeling responsible for everybody else. Never truly knowing and loving yourself. That's what's really going on with the thyroid. Cancer, long standing resentments, anger, bitterness. Yeah, it's just some things you got to sit with. I don't call myself a light worker. I'm like, we're a shadow worker. We're all those things that women, oh no, it's just the things we don't talk about. It's like depression. I don't know when and why, but why do people say depression is, oh my God, such a bad thing. That's a very normal human emotion, by the way. When you get too tired of something, when your body goes into protection mode, but we over medicate versus, hey, let's just feel it out. Let's figure out where you're not happy because your happiness means a lot. So that's where health comes from. That's why all of you that message me all the time, like, what are you doing? What's your secret? I understand energetics, emotional intelligence, and those things right there. And I have the right resources and the right tools, period. End of story. I don't do things that are stupid, like over exercising. I've handled any binge eating. I've handled the addictions, the obsession, obsessions, OCD. I've handled the need to control this over here to make sure I'm this way or what I like surrender. You have to understand how to surrender. You got to know how to call on your power. You've got to understand how to be disciplined. You've got to understand yourself more than you know anything. And when you know yourself, 
world is your oyster. That's all I'm going to say. I give you the secrets, exactly what I did, exactly how I did it in my masterclass. If you haven't watched it, kcship.com forward slash register or just DM me strategy or click the link in my bio. Get it. Watch it. Take notes. It's an old video. Solid. I can't tell you how many lives it has changed and the podcast. Like, go do that shit. Go watch it. Go watch it. It's all about the soul of you. It's not these workouts and these diet plans and all this shit. Y'all, come on, man. It's like they shake away. They shake away. Seriously. Oh, my God. If I hear one more girl say, oh, my God, apple cider vinegar, just do this and do that. Meanwhile, her relationships are shit. She's in scarcity, poverty mindset. She, her self-esteem's in the shitter. And she probably needs to be heavily medicated. And she's just, nothing's working in her life. But, oh, this is good. This is this one thing. Jesus, can't she? doesn't want to do it I could go on that's not your story anymore so go watch the training click the link in the bio DM me strategy I'll get it over to you and let's see what's going on you're right there on the cusp it does not have to be hard choose out of the struggle and actually create your health create your new story create your life you do not have to go out like your mom did you do not have to go out like anybody in your family did there you go tell them Casey said that talk to you soon bye